Hello everyone and welcome back to Simple Tech Digital. In today's video, we're going to go over how to save iMessage audios on your iPhone. We will also be going over and taking a look at a few other ways to save the iMessage audio and make sure that it does not expire. So without further ado, let's jump right inside of the video. So for example, let's just test this out and send a audio message to myself. And just for a side note, all audio messages sent on iMessage usually expire after two minutes and you will not be able to recover the message back. So to keep this iMessage audio from expiring, all you have to do is click on the word keep underneath the iMessage and that will keep the audio in the iMessage conversation. And as a side note to add to that, if I were to delete this conversation thread, that would also delete the voice message or audio messages that were sent. Now, another way to save the audio message that was sent is by saving the audio message to the downloads. And I'll show you guys how to do that. So to save this message to our downloads, all we're going to do is tap and hold the audio message and then click on copy. After we have clicked on copy, the next thing we're going to do is head over to our files folder. You can find your files application by simply searching your app library and just typing in files. And once you've found that, you're just going to open up files. And once you've opened up files, the next thing you're going to do is click on the browse icon in the bottom left corner. The next thing we're going to do is just simply hold and paste the audio message that we just copied. And as you can see, the audio message was pasted. Now you can listen back to this audio, you can send this audio to someone else, you can email this audio, you can text the audio, however you'd like, you can do that when it's pasted in here. However, for example, let's say you do not want to go through all these steps of copying and pasting the audio message into the iCloud. There is another way of saving your audio messages and not have them expire. So to do that, the first thing we're going to do is head over to our settings. After we have clicked on settings, the next thing we're going to do is simply scroll down until we see messages. Once you see messages, you're going to simply click on messages and you'll be brought towards this screen right here. The next thing you're going to do is simply scroll down all the way down until you see audio messages. And here you'll see expire after two minutes. Now, if you were to click expire after two minutes, you will be brought towards the screen right here. On this page, you can change the audio messages from expiring after two minutes to never so that you won't ever have to save your audio or copy it and put it into the iCloud. So if you guys have found this video helpful, please remember to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Thank you.